Hi, I'm glad you could join me today. I have another uh, scripture on healing. Uh, if you remember last week we talked about blind Bartimaeus. Well, this week we're talking about the lady with the issue of blood. And I'm going to read it in Mark chapter 5, verse 25. And a certain woman, which had an issue of blood, 12 years, and had suffered many things of many physicians, and had spent all that she had, and was nothing better, but rather grew worse. When she had heard of Jesus, came in the press behind him and touched his garment. He, uh, if you notice, it said, when she heard of Jesus. Uh, that tells me that we need to hear something and then we can start believing. But some people feel like they don't have time to sit and hear. But if you want results, that's what you're gonna to have to do. You're gonna to have to hear the word of God because the word of God brings you faith. In the next verse, number 25, for she said, if I may touch but his clothes, I shall be made whole. And straightway, the fountain of her blood was dried up and she felt in her, in her body that she was healed of that plague. And Jesus immediately knowing in himself that virtue had gone out of him, turned about in the press and said, who touched my clothes? So if you'll notice uh, that she did exactly like blind Bartimaeus did, we talked about it last week. She heard, she said, and she felt. And so there's three, so there's some steps that we have to go through because faith comes by hearing. And I'm so thankful that we do have uh, healing for our bodies because sometime in our lifetime, we will definitely need it. But uh, verse 30, uh, 34, it says, uh, uh, And he said unto her, Daughter, thy faith hath made thee whole. Go in peace and be free of your plague. And uh, you notice he called her daughter because uh, she was seeking him out, and I believe she was his daughter. And he's so kind to us. And uh, I want to give a shout out to Richard today because he, uh, he uh, asked us for prayer. We still have you on the prayer list, and I got the praise report that he is doing better. Praise the Lord. I'm so happy for that. And uh, I'll visit with you again next week. And with all my heart, I just wish you happiness and health and everything you need in your life. In Jesus' name, bye-bye.